Hey everybody, it's Jen. Thank you so much for joining me today. I just got in three new Christmas paper pads from DCWV and I ordered them from the Frantic Stamper. Um, she had sent out a newsletter um, a few days ago, last weekend, and said that these were in. So I hopped on the site and ordered a few. I think they're still available as well as some other ones. So I will link the DCWV paper pads down below in my description. But um, I wanted to come on and show these to you before my Friday haul, just, you know, just so you could see them as soon as possible, just in case you're interested in any of them. So um, they're all six by six. The first one I got is called Holly Jolly, and it's double-sided printed cardstock, half with gold foil, 24 sheets, and there's two of each. So let's go ahead and take a look. Um, this is the first page, pretty pink background with some gold foiling on the red flowers. And I'll go through the, the back side of the papers after I go through the front, okay? So there's two of those. This page is a white background with like retro pastel color starbursts and little gold diamonds and gold starbursts. Very cute. Then we have a green background with white snowflakes. Two of those. This one's beautiful. Pink background with Christmas trees. Some have lights on them. Some have um, snow. And there's, oh, okay, there's like different color lights and stuff. Really, really cute. And then white with gold foil. Polka dots. Really cute Santa faces. Love those. Their paper pads are so nice. The quality is awesome. I love that they're double-sided. Then there's a red plaid, two of those. Then we have this beautiful print with, looks like, I guess those are poinsettias, pine cones, holly leaves, pine needles or pine boughs. Really beautiful. So a couple of those. And then an ugly sweater, not really ugly sweater, sweater print with scarves and mittens on a dark blue background. The colors are beautiful on this. Then a stripe that mixes all the different colors or combines all the different colors. Pretty presents with foiling. And then there are some tags that are super cute. I like how they put the, the hole kind of through the, the hole on that tag. That was a good idea. But these are really, really cute. Cute small size. Okay, so let's flip it over and do the back. And we have some... Uh, pine cones and um, holly on another print, another page. Light green background with white snowflakes. Let me zoom in a little bit more. Oh, that's too much. Yeah, I think that'll be best. Then we have stockings, all pretty pinks and mint greens, darker greens, some white, a, like a lighter red color. And then a green plaid. This is beautiful. It's like a tonal print, uh, pink with darker, well, like that, that light red color, um, pine boughs, pine cones, and then another ornament toss print. It's so detailed. See all the different patterns on the ornaments? Really, really nice. Their paper pads are such good quality. And then there are candy canes with little ties on them. Sorry for that shadow there that's better okay yeah maybe like this and then we have some holly holly berries holly leaves on a pink background and then oh this house print is so cute right pinks and reds and greens just beautiful it combines like traditional colors but makes them kind of whimsical with the pink cute 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 snowmen totally adorable and then this print with the santas and candy canes and snowmen and trees and snowflakes on the pink oh and then this cute like a uh, kind of like a geometric print i think that's it yep okay so that one is holly jolly let's go on to the next one this one is called Cozy Noel, and I just love the soft greens in this. I haven't looked through it yet, but this is, again, 24 sheets, half with, oh, this one says rose gold foil, double-sided cardstock. So let's go through the 
first or the um, first side first, and we have some cut aparts right away. Spread love and cheer, Merry Christmas, naughty nice. I tried, tis the season, holly jolly, pretty rose gold foil. Another, um, this is similar to the other one, but the green is kind of darker. And it has a pink background with red and green flowers and leaves and pine. Oh, this is gorgeous. Isn't that pretty? Look at the uh, foiling on that. Oh, even the snowflakes are foiled. Really love that one. And then a stripe print. Oh, I love the house one. Take a look at that if you can see it. And the birds beneath that. Those look like... They're blue jays or cardinals? Probably cardinals, right? I don't know. We get both uh, in the winter time here. So, yeah, gorgeous. Okay, and then another little village print. Eee, so cute. Oh, I love these. I don't know why I love village prints so much. It's just, I don't know, kind of nostalgic and homey. And then here's, this is like a, I don't know if that's black background or just a really dark green. But very nice and wintry. Teeny tiny print of presents and hats and mittens and stockings, snowflakes. And it's got the greens. This one is definitely more muted than the Holly Jolly, but still um, really nice, pretty colors. Soft, soft colors. Oh, that Santa print is nice. Can you see the rose gold foiled polka dots back there? I don't know if you can. We angle it a little bit, and they're all throughout. Yeah, there we go. Cute. And then, ooh, this is kind of a bold print, but it'd be a nice uh, background or frame for a card. Yeah, very pretty. Ooh, and this one too. Ooh, this is rose gold with like a black background, and it's kind of a plaid. Very interesting. Love it. And then we have a black print with Christmas text on it. It says, "'Tis the season to be jolly. May your days be merry and bright. Believe in the magic of Christmas. Good tidings of comfort and joy. It's my favorite time of the year. Nice sentiments. Oh, these are adorable. Little mason jars filled with fun things. Snowmen and sleds, snowflakes. Let's see, there's a truck. The snowflake one has like a little tag on it. The house. Oh, these are adorable. Oh, I really didn't need any new paper pads, but, you know, I couldn't resist. Okay, so here's the back side, and we'll just go through that pretty quickly. Um, there's like a holly print there. Oh, this is nice. Looks kind of Nordic. Love the black on the white. That's unusual for, you know, for a Christmas paper pad. Love it. Oh, and there are those cardinals. I'm just going to call them cardinals. Although, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, cardinals. That's so pretty. Very tonal. Good for winter. Doesn't have to be a Christmas card. Ooh, this is nice too. Yeah, this is quite Nordic looking. Tan with darker tan print on it. Right? Isn't that beautiful? I don't know. I think it is. I like this kind of stuff. And there's white with red snowflakes. Happy holidays, season's greetings, believe in the magic. These are cute. You could fussy cut circles around. Well, I couldn't fussy cut a circle, but maybe you could. Or just use like a circle die or a punch over those. Those would be cute centers for wreaths. And this is a very like soft pinky peach background with holly leaves. Tiny holly leaves. And then, oh, that's a pretty like prim plaid. I like that. And then this one has, oh, this is so tiny. It's like hmm, circles with, I don't know, bows or wreaths in there. Can you see that? I don't know if you can see that. It's really, really small. And I have my reading glasses on too. I can't really make it out. Here's that pinky peach background with a pretty soft white um, print on it. Lovely. Very soft. Oh, and then this is nice too. This is black with dark green pine branches on it. And then we have, I think that's dark green, right? With like tiny little specks on it. I think that's it. Yep. So that's nice. Cozy Noel. I think that's 
aptly named. Okay, so there's those two. And let's move on to the next one. This one is called Frosted Peppermint, and this has half with holographic foil. Mm. It looks like red to me, but maybe it's like red holographic. We'll see inside. And I haven't looked at it yet, but um, I was very excited about this one because I it just looked really pretty on the website. Okay, so for the first side, we have some cut aparts, super cute tags, just like little, um, you know, things to add to embellishments or journaling. The stockings were hung by the chimney with care. Oh, Christmas tree. Oh, this is cute. It says joy. Oh, I like that snowman too. Season's greetings. Little journaling spot. Um, this is, well, I won't say red because everything's going to be red in this, but this is like a plaid. Oh my gosh, you guys, look at that gingerbread. Oh, he is so cute. He's got little bow ties, like three bow ties on his tummy and then the red foiled hearts in between. Oh, wow. This is cute. When this, when I, can I get this in a 12 by 12? I'm going to do that because I need more of that. Ooh, look at that foiled stripe. It says holographic, but I mean, it doesn't have, does holographic mean? I don't know. It looks foiled to me. I don't know what the difference is. And then we have red with like a kaleidoscope snowflake print. I said I wasn't going to say red, but I did. Ooh, there are those uh, foil trees. Beautiful. And all oh, these cute Santa, they have foiled hats. And he says, ho, ho, ho. The hats are a little bit different. Some have hearts on them. Some have snowflakes. Some have trees, stars. Ah, adorable. Ooh, look at this one. This one's got a total foil background with non-foil trees. Ooh, that's pretty. Oh, these are so cool. And then, ooh, this is a very muted tonal, uh, I was going to say red, but print <laughs> with holly leaves and branches and stuff. Dark red. Okay, and this one is uh, just very soft pink with white print on it. Botanicals, Christmas botanicals. Ooh, look at these poinsettias. Loving this red holographic foil. Maybe it's holographic because there are like little like dots in the foil. Is that what that means? Like texture in the foil? I don't know. I get confused between the whole holographic and iridescent. And then, okay, this is a muted uh, snowflake print. I think that's the last one. Yeah. Okay, so let's flip over, go the other side. Got this really pretty small gingham, nice and prim. Ooh, look how pretty that is. It's so simple, but just elegant and lovely. And then this one's kind of brownish. And it's got the uh, pine branches with the pine cones on it, some snowflakes. I like how all these colors go together. It's not necessarily one shade of red, you know. There's a pretty, like, tile pattern. Can you see that? Sorry about the lighting. Jeez. That's like a soft pink. Ooh, another pink with white snowflakes. And, oh, this is fun, like candy canes tossed around and little, like, peppermint ball candies. See those? Not just, like, the plain peppermints. These are, these look ball-shaped. And some Christmas sentiments, Silent Night, Noel, Holly Jolly, Holiday, Eggnog, Peace, Christmas Greetings, December. Cute, cute, cute. Oh, and there's some peppermints. These are, like, either from the top or from, uh, or they're the, like, regular peppermint candies on a pink background and then these are like winter berries beautiful get near the end this is that dark dark red with a very faint poinsettia print so you can use this as a solid even though it has a, a print because it's so muted yeah and I was going to say, I thought they were, I could kind of see hearts, but I think it's the foil printing from, from the uh, gingerbread one coming through. But that's kind of cool. Not that I would use this side. That gingerbread side takes a starring role there. 
And then we had this, okay, this is like one of those lighter red backgrounds with a white poinsettia print and berries on it. This might be, nope, there's another one. Okay, and then we have just tiny, tiny white snowflakes and like a grid kind of, diagonal grid. Okay, so that was Frosted Peppermint. The one before that was Cozy Noel, and the first one was Holly Jolly. Thank you so much for joining me for this flip through. I was so excited to show you guys. Um, I was excited to get them and I can't wait to start crafting with them. So again, I'll leave the link down below to the DCWV new Christmas paper pads on the Frantic Stamper website. Thanks for watching. I'll be back soon with another crafty video and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.